guys, I'm down here at Plant City, Rain Fog Ranch. That's right, isn't it? I did get it right, I think. Um, I'm down here with Gretchen. She called us up about an opossum that she's got here. It's beautiful down here, guys. They've got seven acres down here. It's magic. And they're just setting themselves up actually to be a 501c3 like us for equine uh, therapy. So, uh, you know, we want to try and support everybody that does a 501c3 to care for our animals. Now, you know, all of you guys out there are animal freaks like we are. So I want to shoot and show you, this, this is an opossum that they've got here. Now it's never been held by man, and look, I say this on every bloody video to you people, don't do what I'm doing, but I just want to show you the nature of the beast of these things. Now these animals cop such a friggin' bad rap in this country, it's your only marsupial for nothing, absolutely nothing. So he, we're over here with him, right? So. He's wild, he's never been held, he's just been shoved in this bucket here, which is great. I'm going to pick him up. Now he's going, oh, 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 oh. Come here. Who are you? Who are you? I don't know you, I don't know anybody. I'm gaping. And that's about all I'm going to do. Now, I'm not saying do this, and I'm saying don't do it, but I'm saying these animals, they go, oh, look, he's baring his teeth at me. He's frightened. We're going to take him back, he needs rehab work, right? He's, he's very emaciated, right? But this is the nature of these poor creatures that get treated like dirt here by everybody. Don't pick them up like this, because I know what I'm doing, that if he bites me, I don't care, it's not his fault, right? But, and he's just done a little poo on my foot, which is very nice, we've got it going in one end, coming out the other, he's actually been having something to eat. But this is, the reason why I'm showing you this is just, I just feel so bad for these animals, I really do. I mean, and raccoons, you know that, I'm a lover of both, but I really feel for these poor buggers because people say they're ugly. They're only saying they're ugly because of their tail because it's rat-like. It's a prehensile tail, they don't really hang from it, but they use it for balance. They use it to collect stuff as well as they go, no, 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 you're okay, you're okay, you're okay. You're all right. He's just getting a little little nerves here, and you can't blame him. He's never been held before, but look look at the temperament of the of the beast. So he's got dirt and everything all around his mouth. I'm going to take him home, clean him up. We're going to give him some subcute fluids and all that sort of stuff, and get him on the straight and narrow. But these are one of my favourite animals, people, because they're so misunderstood. Who gives a rat's? They've got a bloody rat's tail. Who cares? It's just his tail. You know what I mean? Don't punish him because of that. <laughs> anyway, guys, a uh, big thank you to the uh, Rain Fog uh, Ranch. Here, buddy, come here. Um, for calling us and coming down to be able to get him. And as I say, keep your eye out on them too and follow them. They do equine therapy, okay? All right, guys, see ya.